Now that you have a Raven Hawkeye system, you will need to set it up. If this is an aftermarket install, you will need to delete your original spray boom setup. Don't worry as you will add your sections back to your machine profile after the Hawkeye setup. If this is a completely brand new install, you will need to set up your machine. Just work through the machine selection list or watch the video that covers how to set up a machine profile. The main difference with the Hawkeye system, however, is that you will not select a section setup. Just press the OK button to bypass this process for now. You can work your way through the rest of the tabs to finish the machine setup. You are now ready to set up your Hawkeye system. Press the VT panel. From the setup page, you will have some additional tabs for initial information. To start the setup process, press the Calibration Wizard button. The system will detect the total number of nozzle control valves and CV that you have on your machine. Make sure the total nozzles match the total number you have. If at any time you have a question on a feature or setting, you can press the information button. Now tell the system how many nozzles are on your left section's cabling and press the next button to set your nozzle spacing. Your next setting is the type of nozzles you are using. Choose your tips from the selection list and press the OK button and then the next button. The next step is to assign the order of your NCVs from the inner to outer left nozzles to the inner to outer right nozzles. Once the auto indexing process ends, you can let the Hawkeye system know if you have any fence rows. Enter the number of sections you have and their widths. You can now assign your sections to the number of physical switches you have. On this machine, there are six switches, so a one-to-one -one assignment. Choose your pressure transducer type. You can press the information button for further explanation. Enter your meter cal and the unit of measurement it is based on. Put in a starting target rate and pressure setting. You now need to update your machine profile with your Hawkeye sections. Press the CAN Systems Configuration button and then on your machine configuration. Press the Section tab and then the Plus button. Your Viper 4 will automatically add your section information. Press the Edit button and then the Measurements tab. Enter your offset from the rear axle to your application point measurement. You may need to uncheck the Use Defaults box to enter your measurement. Press the Sections tab. Notice the number of sections is more than the original sections you entered. The Hawkeye system will divide your machine into virtual sections. Please see the video that explains virtual sections for more information. At this point, basic setup is complete.